Hi, kindergarten readers. This is Fusco here. I'm so excited to be working with kindergarten again this week. So before we left school, we talked a lot about stretching beginning sounds, and we even talked about punching the ending sound, but we didn't get a chance to talk about the middle of a word. So I thought we could do that today. Let's get started. is the middle sound of a word anyway? The middle of the word is the part of the word that contains the vowel. And our vowels are A, E, I, O, and U. And those are five letters of the alphabet that are super important because they have two sounds. Today, we're just going to talk about the short vowel sounds. Let's practice our vowel sounds. A, A, apple. E, E, ed. I, I, itch. O, A, octopus. U, A, umbrella. Great job, kindergartners. What is vowel, or the middle sound, in top? If you said O, oh, great job. O is the middle letter, and O makes the A ah sound. So how can we find the middle sound? Do you guys remember stretch? Stretch is our friend from outer space. And if your moms or dads don't know who stretch is, you'll have to tell him that stretch is from outer space and he talks very differently than us. He talks much slower and he helps us hear all the sounds in the word. So when we are trying to figure out our middle sound, we need to make sure we say the word very slowly so we can hear all of the sounds in the word. Sometimes, if you're using stretch, it might be hard to tell when you've reached the middle of the word. So you can use your hand to help you know when you've reached the middle of the word. I call it roller coaster words. Watch Mrs. Fusco as I stretch the word red. 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 When I was at the bottom of my hill, that was the beginning of the word. When I got to the top, that was the middle of my word. And when I came back down the hill, that was the end of my word. Watch me again as I stretch red. Do it with me if you want. What sound did you hear when my hand was up here? If you said eh, you're right. Eh is in the middle of red. Let's do one more together. Sun. Say sun. Now let's stretch it. Sun. What sound did you hear at the top of the roller coaster? If you said uh, oh, you're right. Great job, kindergartners. Let's practice together using our roller coaster. Say the word fox. What sound do you hear in the middle of fox? 
Get your roller coasters ready. Let's stretch. Ah, fox. What sound did you hear at the top of your hill? Ah, if you said ah, you are correct. This time, I'm going to let you stretch this word all by yourself. That is a sun. Get your roller coasters ready. Go ahead and stretch sun. What sound did you hear at the top of your roller coaster? If you heard the uh sound, you're correct. Last one. That's a bat. Stretch bat. What sound did you hear at the top of your roller coaster? If you said ah, kiss your brain. Great job. Now that we've practiced stretching our words using our roller coaster, let's see if we can carefully listen to that middle sound and sort our pictures into two different piles. On the top of my chart, I have a web. Let's stretch web. Web. Do you hear that eh sound? Any picture that has the eh sound in the middle is going to go under web. And over here, I have a sock. Let's stretch sock. S-ah-k. Did you hear that ah sound at the top of your roller coaster? Any picture that you hear the ah sound at the top of your roller coaster is going to go under sock. Let's get started. My first picture is of a pen. Let's stretch pen. Pen. Hmm. Do you hear the eh sound like in web? Or do you hear the ah sound like in ah? Let's say it one more time. P N. If you think it goes under web, great job. Kiss your brain. Let's move on to the next one. That's a picture of a nest. Let's stretch nest together. N E S T. Nest. I hear that same middle sound. N -e. I hear e, eh, just like in the middle of web. N -e -st. And p n have the same middle sound. So I put them together. Let's look at our next picture. Frog. Let's stretch frog. Frog. Hmm. What sound do I hear? Frog. Where would you put it? You're right. Frog. And Ah, have the same middle sound. What about shell? I'm going to let you stretch shell and decide where you think it would go. Go ahead. Did 
Did you hear the eh sound in the middle? Just like in n, est, and p, n. Great job. Last one is a lock. What sound do you hear in the middle of lock? If you said ah, you were right. S ah, o ah, and fr ah, all have the ah sound in the middle. Awesome job, kindergartners! Now it's time to write. At home, you can either practice, you can air write, you could grab a pencil and write the letters down, or you could pretend to use your finger on the table and write the missing sounds. We're going to use our roller coaster words, our roller coaster words to help us hear the sound and then write the letter that goes with that sound. Our first picture is a net. Let's stretch net. N -et. What sound did you hear in the middle of net? N -et. I hear that e eh sound. What letter makes the e eh sound? You're right, it's an E. Now friends, if that was a little tricky for you, go ahead and pause this video and go grab your keyword chart. You can use that to help you. Okay, we're gonna move on to the next picture. That's a picture of a hat. Let's stretch hat. At. I heard the ah sound in the middle of that word. What vowel, what letter makes that ah sound? Like apple. If you wrote A, kiss your brain. Okay. The next picture is lip. Let's stretch lip. L -ip. I heard the I sound at the top of my roller coaster. What letter makes the I sound? Check your keyword chart if you're not sure. I is I, I says I, just like itch. Okay, I'm going to let you stretch the next picture by yourself. That's a picture of a log. What sound did you hear at the top of your roller coaster? Did you hear the Ah sound? What letter makes that ah sound? You're right, it's an O. Okay, Mrs. Fusco is going to let you do the last two by yourself. Bun. Stretch the word bun. do you hear in the middle of bun? What letter makes that sound? Did you say you? Amazing job. Great listening ears. Our last picture is of a map. Stretch map. What 
sound do you hear in the middle? What letter makes that sound? If you said A, kiss your brain. Great job. I hope you had fun practicing stretching words and listening for the middle sound. I know I sure did. And remember, when you're writing, use roller coaster words to help you hear all the sounds in the word. Until next time, bye bye butterflies and keep reading.